according to Professor Adrian Rowlin from the National University of Singapore, each of us has a 1 in 286,000 chance in getting hit in a year. That is the same odds as winning the local lottery. So where did the lightning strike? It, it hit a fence, uh -huh. and that's less than 10 metres uh, from me, which is as close as between here and there. Really near. It's the loudest thing I've ever heard in my life. Oh. And uh, the, the charges uh, distributed, and I was holding an umbrella, mm -hmm. and it hit the umbrella, and then I could feel the pain coming down my arm. Oh dear. Yeah, and I fell flat on the ground. And you were knocked out? Uh, maybe for a brief second. Did you sustain any injuries? No, I didn't. Not at all? No. Contrary to common belief, mm. uh, most people who are struck by lightning do survive. Here we're looking at the what we call the lightning down conductor. Its job is to uh, uh, intercept and uh, discharge the lightning energy safely to ground. So if you look at uh, the railings in detail, you see mm -hmm. that the lightning conductor tapes actually electrically bonded to I the railing. I see. Okay. Right. What, what might happen? if I were to stand near this conducting strip during a storm? So there is a, a portion of the uh, lightning current that can flash, right? Because it seeks an alternative path. So ah. if you are in the, the way, you're in harm's way. So what happens if this conductor is not in place? The lightning energy will find a way to discharge irrespective. So you get uh, reports about chunks of concrete falling down to the oh floor. And does the lightning get into our water pipes as well? Because water conducts electricity, right? Yes, it gets into any metallic structures. So, so we at home, in our homes, we yes. might get electrocuted also if we are near an appliance during if that point. If the lightning protection system is uh, uh, if it's faulty, not working, uh, okay. We are fine, no worries. But generally, nothing will happen because the aircraft structure is made out of general aluminium alloy. When the lightning hits the plane, it will just fly past the aircraft and actually can get discharged back to ground. So like the instruments here, nothing will flicker? Aircraft manufacturers have uh, done many years of research and development and they also have gone to rigorous testing to ensure that the avionics systems, electrical systems can withstand these kind of conditions. Not even a shudder? No. The number one lightning hotspot in the world is not even a city with towering skyscrapers. It is Lake Maracaibo. Right there, in Venezuela, South America, some 232 lightning flashes occur in each square kilometre every year. Singapore, however, sees only 17 flashes per square kilometre per year, according to the National Environment Agency.